Hello Sagittarius, this is a general reading for you guys for the upcoming week, the 13th through the 21st. This reading is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Let's see, what's going on with my Sagittarius? What's going on with my Sagittarius? Hang on one second guys, I always have to put a backup audio on here because sometimes my... Camera X, crazy. What's going on with Sagittarius this upcoming week? Page of Cups. Hmm. I feel like you guys have taken interest in someone or something, and I think it it fulfills you um, somewhat. But you know, you're not really sure about it. Is a is a thing here. I think it's something new that has occurred. Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy was challenging you. Here is the Five of Cups. I feel like this is telling you to, if it's something that you feel like you're interested in, sometimes you just have to take a chance on it or you may live to regret it here with the Five of Cups energy. Yep, Scorpio energy there. <clears throat> What is the underlying issue? I feel like you guys have not had a lot of luck. Um, there, there has been a lot of sadness surrounding you lately. And this is for you to allow yourselves to be happy. Take this situation for what it is right now, okay? That's Leo energy. Take full control over it. Take it by the reins. And get your happiness, okay guys? What was going on in the recent past for Sagittarius? Strength. Leo energy again. You guys have been fighting some urge, some tendency to do something that may not have been in your best interest before. And I feel that you were kind of leery about involving yourselves in situations that could make you have like this setback. Okay. Do not deny yourself happiness. Go ahead and step out on a limb, okay? <clears throat> you can control yourselves. You know exactly what it is that you need to do and what you don't need to do. You know this. You got this, okay? Crowning thoughts for Sagittarius here. You want to take that leap of faith. You want to jump out. You want to take that leap of faith, but a lot of you guys are afraid that you're going to end up falling on your face. That it's not going to pan out for you. Aries energy. Hmm. It's coming in for Sagittarius. Ten of Wands. Feeling burden. Something's weighing very heavily on you. And I feel like you guys are thinking way too much about something here. Way too much about it. And it's like, instead of it having this, this happy effect on you, it's going to start really kind of dragging you down. Okay? This is your card here. Is there something new that you want to do and you feel like it's not going to work out for you? Hmm. How is Sagittarius viewing this situation? How are they viewing this situation? Ten of Swords. Wow. Hmm. You feel overpowered by this situation. Is there some sort of I'm I'm you know I hope this is not a situation where you guys are recovering from some addiction and you're really being tried right now. You're really being like pushed to the limit um, in this situation. Because I'm feeling for a lot of you, not a lot of you, but for some of you, this has everything to do with some sort of addiction. Whether it's a sexual addiction, gambling addiction, some sort of addiction that you guys 
have struggled to like overcome and now there's something happening in your life where you're finding it harder and harder to fight that addiction it almost feels like somebody you feel like somebody betrayed you and it's setting you back or it's trying to set you back but you're stronger than that if somebody has not told you that I'm telling you that you're stronger than that you can fight this you can fight it there's definitely this feeling of being hurt of feeling stabbed in the back feeling like um, this has happened too many times to you Gemini energy there there's a struggle going on within you cars are flying out here put those back in there what's influencing my Sagittarius but if there's something that you guys feel like is making you happy but you feel like it's too good to be true there's something there's something like that too that's going on here and in that case you have to allow yourself to be happy okay what's influencing Sagittarius page of Pentacles doing something different exploring your options reaching out for help if you guys are um, recovering and you're finding it hard to keep going uh, reaching out for help because there are avenues out there that you can explore that will help you along and I'm sure you know that if you are recovering at it if this is a situation for you where um, something seems too good to be true then it's for you to really kind of step out on faith which is something that I feel like some of you have had a hard time doing is, is placing your faith uh, somewhere else I think you've had a hard time with that. I feel like some of you are, are looking for an apology as well from someone. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. And it's kind of fucking with you that this person has not done that. <clears throat> Hopes or fears for Sagittarius. Knight of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. Yeah, that you can be happy. That somebody still wants you. That they're still interested in you. That they still care about you. There's somebody that I, I'm, I'm feeling like you guys are hoping that, you know, they come in and almost save you from yourself. Save you from this misery. Overall outcome here for Sagittarius. Two of Cups. Love it. Two of Cups. They're here. This person does love you. They do care about you. They do want to be with you. This is your soulmate. There's chemistry here. There's future happiness here for you. Okay. So that is what I have for you, and I'll be speaking with you guys soon. Namaste.